Angel's Landing is known for being the most dangerous hike in the United States. I bet this is not the first video you watched about Angel's Landing in Zion National Park. So in this video, you'll learn about what to bring on this hike and what to be careful of. There are chain rails along the entirety of the hike. So if you hold on to those tight, then you should be fine. Accidents usually happen when tourists are busy with taking photos or videos. Another reason why the rating of this hike is hard is because you need to climb up and down very very often and usually at the side of the cliff. Here I stopped to put my hats in my backpack because it was super windy up there and you should probably put your hats in the backpack if you don't want to lose it. It's recording. Yeah, yeah. As you can see in the video, you're literally walking at the side of the cliff and your life depends on the chain rail, so hold on to it tight. Hey, that worked. Another thing is, it was kind of gloomy the day we went to Angel's Landing. Job. I hope this is a good idea. And the hike is highly not recommended to do on a rainy day, or even if the ground is just wet. Oh, okay. It could be very dangerous. From this point, we're just climbing straight up. The hike is more like a climb at this point. And from this part, the hike is more like a one lane hike. The hikers from one lane have to wait for the hikers from the other lane to pass through before they can keep going. Whoa, that's real. This is a good example of exactly what you shouldn't be doing. Just don't film and walk on Angel's Landing. Just, just don't. Alright. Oh, first, stop recording. views are pretty awesome and yeah now it's a good time to film Edward almost there almost landed so our original plan is to wake up at 5 and go to see the sunrise on the angels landing even though we didn't get to see the sunrise but the views are really cool uh, just saying we woke oh up at God. 5 and it took us around three hours to get to the top very strenuous hike so definitely remember to bring snacks or food. Our friends Neil and Jessica woke up an hour late so we met up with them and went to explore the Narrows which is another amazing hike. Unfortunately it looked like this. I don't think I'm going in there. Look at that water. Impossible. Flash flood warnings. Damn. Rainy day. Wow. This is waterproof. And this is waterproof also. <laughs> Either way, you're waterproof. <laughs> this is option one, this is option B. <laughs> there are certain seasons that the Narrows will experience flesh Yo. flood. What's up, bro? What's up? Waterproof. Waterproof, waterproof boys. boys. Waterproof also. <laughs> waterproof. Originally, you can walk in this beautiful, uh, well, not as beautiful water into the canyon to explore, but obviously, we cannot this time. And also, I think we got really lucky because it started raining in the afternoon, but not in the morning. I'm really glad it started raining only after we finished Angel's Landing. Thank you. I used the voiceover control on my GoPro quite a lot on the hike, and Neil was interested. So I was showing him how it's working. Hey, GoPro, take a picture. Photo, photo. Hey, GoPro, take a photo. and the sky cleared up when we were about to leave. So we decided to drive back into the park and take a last look at how beautifully amazing this park is.
If you like this video, help me like and subscribe my channel or send this video to someone who will find this helpful. I am Antares and I'll see you on my next adventure. My Aldi April 2009 Utah Zion National Park.